everyone, a bit of a different video for me, let me just zoom out a sec. So I'm just sat down on the floor and I've been doing research for the past like hour and I'm really confused by this and I kind of need your help with it, um, especially if you're like hairdressers or anything like that at all. So basically I purchased this Olaplex from Amazon, it is the number three um, hair perfecter, but basically I bought this from Amazon for about 25 quid something around there and I've just gone on to look at the reviews and there's a lot of reviews on there in terms of like how authentic this product is and it's even gone as far as to cause damage to people's hair and scalp and so when I come to wanting to use this today I was a bit skeptical about it to be fair. Now first and foremost the things that were kind of convincing me is first of all it looks like Olaplex have got a store on Amazon because at the top you can sort of see the, the retailer and it does say Olaplex. When I click onto it, it doesn't actually take me to an authentic Olaplex selling page because it lists things like Redken, um, you know, some other brands as well as Olaplex as well. And it's probably like the most purchased, I think it is the most purchased product on Amazon in terms of like hair care and repair and stuff. And the other things that were convincing me is that when you go onto Olaplex website, they do say that you have a QR code scanner, which I do have. There's a barcode, etc. So there's a bit of ruffling um, on the packaging, like here. Can you see that line? And like I said, it's got the QR code, it's got the scanning code, whatever else. So it's got everything, like it genuinely looks legit. But I went onto the Olaplex website and Amazon is not, <laughs> sorry, I'm so close. Amazon is not a listed retailer, so they cannot guarantee that it's authentic. Um, but the other thing that was sort of bugging me, other than this line here, I don't know if that is just, you know, where I've stored it, I, I didn't take notice of it when it arrived. The only thing that's bugging me is this section here, this 12 months expiry. And when I went onto the, like Olaplex website and you look at their products, it quite clearly says 24 months. So I'm really, really skeptical about this. And the reason I'm doing this video is firstly, can you guys help me? Have you purchased this off Amazon before? Do you know if it's real or fake? There are licensed um, hairdressers that are saying mixed reviews that it is fake. I don't know, I'm just really put off by this and I've used it once on my hair already. And I've gotta be honest, like it wasn't bad. It didn't do anything damaging to my hair. Like when I scan this little barcode, it does take me straight to the Olaplex website, which I don't know if you can, you probably could easily just manipulate that, I guess. Um, in terms of like the smell, oh my God. In terms of the consistency though, let me just show you it. It doesn't feel watery, like it feels really soft. And it smells really clean, but it kind of smells just like a normal, I'm really conscious of still on my lip. Just smells like a normal, like herbal essence conditioner, which is odd. Um, but I don't remember the other one having much of a smell. I, I don't know. Um, so yeah, I'm really put off by the expiry date. Um, you know, the whole fact that Olaplex isn't listed, like Amazon isn't listed on the Olaplex website. Is this fake? Is this real? I don't know you guys, can you please help me leaving down some comments down below. Um, if this is fake, I mean I have contacted Amazon, but if this is fake, this is, you know, quite serious to be fair and the seller should not be allowed to get away with this if this is fake. If it's not then obviously happy days and stuff, but if this is fake, you know, it's quite concerning and it brings up this whole message of, you know, safety in terms of you're putting this on your hair to do a task and if it's not doing that, if it's doing like the complete opposite, that's really concerning. But also the chemicals in it as well, how do we know that these are genuinely the chemicals and they've just not done like a replica of the ingredients? So I don't know, I just wanted this to be quite a short video. Um, let me know your thoughts, help a girl out and leave your experience down below because you could help me and others as well. I'll be doing some normal videos soon but I just wanted to do this really short one because, you know, I'm just a bit concerned about it and I paid 25 quid for it, do you know what I mean? I don't want that to go down the drain. So let me know your thoughts, comments, it's greatly appreciated and I shall see you in my next video. Bye.